That barrel is one of six of these barrels. And all six of them spawn in the refugee area here. I gotta get the material out of that barrel. Uh, because that's like the only naturally spawning... One of the only naturally spawning rain barrels. Uh, but you see like this barrel over here... That barrel's not one of them because it has the top. So you can't use that one as a rain barrel. Remove logs. That's that, that's how you do it. So now that, that now that it's empty, we can pick it up. What does that say? Too heavy for inventory. Okay, we'll drop off some stuff. Why do I have five logs? Oh, the five logs from the thing. Okay, that's that's what I removed with those those five logs. So we should be able to grab it now. So I'll keep that in mind for next time that we're gonna grab logs as soon as we empty it. Yes. Okay, I don't think it weighs that much either. Oh, it weighs ten. Okay, I think we're gonna try to evac now. We got two of the barrels, which is better than nothing. I think we got two propane tanks as well. Uh, we're getting exerted. Maybe we'll place it right over by the door here. Right there. Excellent. So that can hold 800 units of water. Um, but I think as long as the frames are in place and it also has a roof then it counts as completely enclosed. I'm pretty sure. Let's see. I got my pipe wrench on me? I do. sink. Excellent. Plum chrome sink. Excellent. So we'd be plumbing. Yeah, we got 52 units of water right here. Excellent. We got a working sink. Finally. Right behind this fence there's a metal barrel. <laughs> I plumbed it to that sink. It's, uh, it's not outside but it's not inside either. So this frame around around my deck here, this the top of the deck here acts as the um, as the roof of that room, and the frame here, even though it's non-completed walls, you can jump through it, and now technically inside, which is the best kind of uh, uh, jam right here. But now I can I can drink. Uh, drink from the sink, I can fill my water bottles, and I believe since it's, I don't know if it counts as the safe house or not, but maybe you guys can come by and grab some water out of that. You're more than welcome to if you're in the area. But this barrel right here, this barrel I had to go all the way, let's pull up the map, I had to go all the way up to the um, refugee area past the checkpoint in order to grab it like this area right here this there should be four more of them over there and and basically they're level three rain barrels so the rain barrel that you can originally you can make when you get to when you get to carpentry four you can make the first rain barrel and that holds 200 units of water i think after you get to level 7 or level 8 of carpentry you can make the next level up rain barrel that holds 400 units uh, but this metal drum right here that holds 800 so it's like basically level 3 um, it is vanilla in the game and, it, and you notice that it doesn't have the top here 
it's it's there's a bunch of them around in like farmhouses that have tops you can't use those barrels you can only get the ones from the checkpoint for this they start off with a bunch of wood in them you throw the logs onto the ground and then um, and then you pick up the barrel and go and so I got another one of these inside thank you very much for watching and subscribe for more videos